How cool is that interview, right? I mean, come on. It looks great. Now, it looks a little weird because I'm interviewing myself, so that's odd. But besides that, it looks great. And it's, I tell you, it's that one trick of knowing which way your hand is pointing that helps frame you in the right frame. I tell you, I, I came up with that years ago, and it has helped students know how to frame an interview. Because if they're on the wrong side of the frame over here and they're looking this way, I mean, that just looks weird, right? And so it's the way to get the eyes to line up. And it is, it is the biggest secret that interviewing, has, you know, I tell you, I, you will thank me for years, okay? But anyhow, let's get to your turn. Now it's your turn, okay? So to be able to earn this badge, you need A, you need to interview yourself, okay? So come up with, you know, three questions and that kind of stuff for your, yourself. And uh, B, you need to interview somebody for some project you're working on in class, okay? So if it's just a fellow classmate, or if it's your teacher or another teacher in the building, the librarian, the principal, whatever you have, or maybe it's your parents, something you need to interview another person and have at least three questions, okay? So I need a three question interview, maybe it's a 10 question interview, but that, that could be really long. And in it, you need to have uh, reactionary shots, so the whole, those kind of things where you don't say anything, but you just react. So you need to have reactionary shots and you need some additional shots. We call it um, B-roll, where if I'm talking about how I like to play basketball, then there better be some pictures of basketball that come in over the top of that, okay? So you need to have those uh, things involved in it. Just like when, when we did the volcano one, I added, well, I talked about wearing a silver suit, suddenly you see a picture of a volcanologist in a silver suit. So you need to have those things in there. Of course you need the other things, the sound needs to sound good, and it needs to be lit well. It needs to have you know the steady shot, no nothing jiggling and everything. So keep that in mind. And once you've got that in, turn it in to whoever does the grading for badges in your building. And uh, bada boom, bada bing, you will have the video three interview badge.